Hello, World Wide Web. I'm Decker Shadow, the internet personality with the best hair. Back on planet base after a long, long time. Pressing again. Yes, here we are. We'll go f Look at this place. It's huge. We got people. We got the. Oh, man. I have no idea. I can't even remember all of what I was doing. Okay, we got that. Holy shit. What do I have? What do I need? Uh, we got, we're catching 84%, so we need more telescopes to find everything. And more anti-meteor lasers. We got the radio antenna, we could use another one of those. What do we need right now? Power, power. There was something going with, on with power, I can't remember. I should have watched the last Planet Base video before starting this up to catch up on what the hell I was doing, where the fuck I'm going. Hello, ship. Colonists. Uh, this, we just got a tourist. Okay, people just hanging out like, yeah. Just like to see what's going on here. Okay, so... Uh, well, an our intruder has been detected. Guards? We got our... That motherfucking visitor? My first Taurus was a terrorist! Taurus was a So we got terrorists. For tourists. New engineer. Okay. It's fine. Need some space engineers. Everyone needs space engineers sometime. Okay. Just give you that. Boom. We got genetically modified tomatoes. Fast production, high maintenance. Say, so make some of that right there. Boom. Let's just build a pyramid, what the hell? What are, the, what are my milestones I need to get? A power monger, 500 kilowatts of power, I need to generate more power, acquire 10 techs, be able to purchase 10 bots, airlock is low on oxygen, structures low on oxygen. Why are those low on oxygen? Well, build oxygen generator. And build a big one. And connect that. That the twenty-seven is valued at four. You cheap bastard. Let's save up a little money. I got the tomatoes. I gotta trade some shit back to him. Trade off the stuff. Get tomatoes going. Pending resources nine. Oh yeah, that's right. That thing takes a bit. Pyramid's just there to show off. But mm -hmm. I felt like showing off. Sue me. And that gives 30 prestige per pyramid, it seems. I don't know if it's like an appreciating value if you, for the things, but it's interesting. It's nice. Oh, the armory can hold 10 guns. So per armory, I could just have like 10. Okay, base management limits. Oh, no, not just 10, just 10. Ugh. 94% with three telescopes. Trading ship, you got super extractor. Okay, so I can get that. Okay, let us get to that super extractor. And then we can build the super extractor out here and get, because that was another thing I was looking at doing. Having a large water extractor so that I can make sure that I'll have plenty of water because I'm also going to need to build another water tower. I got like two here, but it's like mm, always worried that it's going to run out. Oh, I have so much, ex so many extractors, so many of those things, uh, the other things. And all I, the best extractors I can do is like a medium. So get a super going, and we're good. I think the more supers I have going, the less I need overall, and it'll be better on me for spares. I don't need to have a whole bunch of little things like I've got right now and trying to keep them all in working order. Do people really all have to go through the airlock one at a time? I mean, the airlock's a little bigger than that. I understand having to close the door at a time. It's, just, it's an airlock. It's, it's how things are. Super extractor patent. Boom. So I go water extractor. Boom. Holy shit, super extract. Yeah, 
Intruder has been killed. Intruders have been killed. Alright, my guards work. Let people attack in my base. It's a nice base, but with two guys with guns show up and expect to do something. It, it, it's like it, it's 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 like a mugging, except instead of being like, "Hey, I'm going to take your wallet," it's, "Hey, I'm going to take your city." It, no, you're not. Everything's looking all so nice. And that thing's going. And the people working. It's like the, the 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 base works. I can hardly remember a time when this game was infuriatingly difficult. No, I am getting a little concerned with the biodomes. Hmm. I got an idea. Should be fine. And more people. Of course we got more people. That's one reason why I was like, I'm definitely going to need to build another biodome. If my food supply, the spare foods that I was selling, I'm not recovering them nearly as fast as I want. And we're getting more and more people. It's time to build another biodome. I want to see some, build something that loops around here and connects these two sides. And I'd also like to get things going with uh, building a larger landing pad. So I can get in larger ships, more people at once, but I can get a little hectic, but then again, this has been a long time since this game's been hectic for me. I was a little concerned about loading this game up for so long, because it's like, holy shit, things are stable. How... Sandstorm imminent. Hopefully the amount of power over what I needed for how many days is gonna help. Because shit, I hate when that happens. Power storage is low, I, I figured. Trading ship. I don't really have any. Sp I don't have any spare meat, and I only got nine vegetables. So yeah, I'm. Uh, I'm gonna have to say no. I'm saving up for stuff. Worker and a biologist. Wait, shift over. Okay. So I need to be able to store more power in order to be able to get. Or no, that's generating. Power. That's how much power is generated versus how much is. In be, yeah, so I need more power collecting, not to get, uh, you know, like solar panels and shit to generate a hell of a lot more power to get the 500 power milestone. Acquire text, build or purchase 10 bots, megalomania, and consolidation. Let's see, as the manufacturing limits for bots, set it to 10. Get at, yeah, get us some roboticizations. Is, Once you get this is the bingy bang. Enough of the bingy bang. Gonna have another place, another control center up here for guards to gather in, because we're gonna have another airlock around there, leading to a large little, you know, thing with people land. This landing pad. Yeah, that one. Just, you can put that many frickin' water fountains up, but you can't put. You, you can't have four tables and even just one meal maker in the. The tables just take up two... Okay, you gotta get that airlock, gonna get that lab together, so it connects those two parts of the base together. And I'm gonna have that thing there, and it's gonna go over, be able to go around further with that. So I can loop around here as well. Well, not here, because that's a dead-end thing, but I could do, maybe have something that connects to that. Oh... Things that go down around here, and all this lovely space over here, I can extend out that way. It's gonna be wonderful. It's gonna be great. Trading ship. I'll trade you ship. What do you got? Oh, fucking. Oh, the driller bot patent. I want it. I want it. I want it. I want it. Take my vegetables. Right. Trade that thing. Get that driller bot patent. And we shall change up our bot building to driller bots and it's gonna be awesome no more basic carrying shit around we're gonna go forth into the mines and get fuck tons of ore oh yeah driller bot patent acquired okay where's my robotics factory I know I got one and 
it's just the same to make a driller bot as it is to make anyone else. Metal, bioplastic, and semiconductor to make a bot. That's another trading ship? Oh, you want that? Well, I don't... Not right now. I'm still... I just spent a lot of stuff. Power monger reached. Boom. You are now generating a ton of power. Good. Because, you know, I was, was I've been trying to do. So, yeah. Made it. Yeah. So we have six milestones done. Still need the, the four more bots for the robotization. Build the monolith. Reach population 300. We're getting really close to that already. Technocracy. Welfare decent. I think it's just because everyone's tired. So I'm working on the dorm. Working on it, guys. So you're just unhappy. It's your morale. F fuck your morale. Building as many as I can, trying to be as exact as possible. And boom! Being exact got me an extra bed. Oh yeah. If I could make like a big apartment tower with a lot of beds, that'd be great. So, you know, all these little domes and shit, they ain't cutting it. These people need sleep, they say. And it's like, okay, here's a way for you to sleep. And they're like, yeah, actually, we're, we're only going to sleep like a couple to the room. See, so this only had one, two, three, four, five. So I could only sleep ten in there. Anyway, I got the other, the cabin, where they're supposedly happier in, but it only can, I only had enough for frickin' seven beds. So it's like, okay, fuck it, these people need to sleep. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Eighteen fucking beds. There you go. Trust me, guys, you want the robots to replace your jobs. It's in the fucking mines. No one wants to work in the damn mines. It's like, it, it's the example of shitty work people gen generally use. We got the semiconductor in place for the tenth? They can frickin' make the bots! Dorm is low on oxygen. What? What? Stop breathing all the air. Do I have to build dorms right next to oxygen generators? Oh, th that practically is. The oxygen generator is right fucking there. Why? These, is it such a pain in the ass to get the oxygen to the places I want them? Like, this damn place, it's 21% oxygen, it's next to three medium oxygen generators. What the fuck? And of course this place is only 20%. It's perpetually shat by that, even though... Fuck, that's only 20%? How is that even possible? It's right next to the... Ugh. A big-ass fucking port for stars and shit. Okay, we just need that one last robot fin... We got it. Robotization reached. Robotization will improve the efficiency of your colony. Boom! Yes. And we got driller bots, and that is awesome. Incoming transmission. A ship containing a large group of fugitives are asking for help. Visitor needs food, water, sleep, reward per visitor. Grant them permission to land. Fugitives? Nah. I got a fuck ton of bioplastic. Dorm is low on oxygen. Dorm's always low on oxygen. People that just like, yeah, we sleep until we choke. Because, fuck air. Why does air have to move past structures? 18%. How are you 18%? How's the oxygen generator at 18%? How could I possibly put that any closer to an oxygen generator? I wish I'd stop complaining about the fucking dorm being low on oxygen, because it's not like I can do anything about it. I, if, if people are going to suck up all the air for existing in there, then there's... What the, what, the, what the fuck? 
I can't help you. Well, stop telling me you look out for this. I can't do shit. Look, I'll even work with you. I'll make you another oxygen generator. That'll make you happy. It ain't gonna help, but I'll do it just for you. Yep. Boom! Gonna be nice colossal panels and mega collectors, finally. Which means if I want to, I could actually dismantle some of my own stuff after I could build up a new array and just get to, like, work it back and recycle and shit and have less that I'll have to mm, actively keep in good shape. Mega collector patent acquired. Colossal panel patent acquired. That is small. Medium. Large. Colossal. What now? What? 270... Oh, it's... Let's give this guy a whole bunch of the starch. Yes, I know I need starch to make the bioplasm, but it's what I got a fuck ton of. So, use what I got. Why not? Power stored. Fucking fate. The sun's up. Sun, yeah, power back. Thank you. What now? Another trading ship. What? Oh, that's a nuts. Such a nice. Big ass solar panel. That solar panel is actually slightly out of my ability to back up that way and see it. But yeah, the new solar panel. Bigger. Massive. Yes. And then the sun sets. Thanks. Everyone is all unhappy right now. Everyone's all like, uh, life is boring and sad and shit. Oh, what's this? Farm dome. Why is everyone so unhappy? What the hell can I do to make you people happy? Huh? Canteen not got enough TVs? One more TVs? I mean, one more TV? Is a TV. Is that enough TV? Is more TVs. Things like the whole wall is TVs. Well, could they stop that? Someone choked to death outside the fucking airlock. Brilliant. Beautiful. Fucking geniuses. But now... I can be like, whoop! Giant fucking biodome! The regular size one already takes up more air than anything makes sense to! But fuck it! What is next time I need to build a biodome? It can be fucking huge! Oh, a massive storage patent, you say? Yes, let's get that patent. Let's get all the techs I need to get that fucking achievement. Two more. And is that that? No, they're, they're, they're taking that to the frickin' trading ship. Massive storage patent acquired. Awesome. Oh, I just need the Goliath Turbine and the Onion. Monolith has been built. Megalomania reached. You have proven what you are capable of. Poof. Monolith. Yes! I just need those two patents, which shouldn't be all that hard to get. The Onion and the Goliath Turbine. All things considered, just keep at it with the bioplastics and we should be set. Sandstorm approaching soon. Yeah, I know. Boom. There we go. I have that Goliath Turbine patent. Then it's just the frickin' onions. And I have all them patents. And then it's just the 300 people. And I got all the milestones on Mars. Goliath Turbine patent acquired. That's great. Incoming transmission. Sizable group of fugitives asking for help. They need food, water, and sleep, and they'll give me money. Uh, nah. Sorry, guys. It's just... I, I don't want to get things fucked up with people running around with guns like, Hey, you have a, this is a nice place you got here. 
Okay, just keep them getting that money and that money and that money, and I probably have enough now that by the time I do run into the genetically modified onion patent, I'll be able to pick that up, which is good. Dorm is low on oxygen, which is bad. You know, I'd really like, I don't know, a very large oxygen generator patent? The oxygen generator that works patent? An oxygen generator that generates oxygen patent? You know, something simple. You know, the, the the one that you just built is closer. You could have, you could have gone in that one. That it it's, it, it it filled with oxygen before you managed to. Yeah. And we can make this trade, and I can get that milestone completed as well. Yes. Now I need to make a bar. Well, I don't need to, but these people are fucking unhappy all the time. So it's like, I hey, drink away your problems. It's okay. Build them a few more places to sleep somewhere, okay? So they don't all have to crowd around the dorm. Because evidently, even though I can fit all those beds in the dorm, and the only thing I can build in the dorm is beds, and I can only have one entrance leading into it no matter how I build it, if I actually fill it with as many beds as possible, people are just going to be, like, choking in there because there's too many people. Because technocracy reached. You now have acquired all relevant texts. Nice. All texts are relevant. It's not... It, it just if they fill the beds and then chokes out the oxygen in the air. It sucks. Being limited on how many beds I'm allowed to put down because otherwise they just breathe too hard. I mean, I'd understand if they weren't, like, well, I, I, they, these are connected to a canteen here, so, uh, there, there's some stuff going on here where they're breathing in here as well, I guess. But at the same time, it's like, why, why are you making it such a pain in my ass? Water storage is critical. Yeah, great. Just make the water extractor and the water tower. Water dome is low on oxygen. <laughs> Fucking stuff. Why, why, why not? Why not? Just. Structures out of water. The biodome. Just make the fucking extractors. Build it. Love of fuck, build it. We still have power. The extractors will work at night. Thanks for the tank. Let's make the extractor. Fitters have paid 20 coins for services. Thanks. Okay, now I have to build that. Build the connector. Build the con Yes. Good. Yeah, I know the low on oxygen ran out of water. So we couldn't run the oxygen generator without getting more water. It was fucking... Yeah, we're working on it. I got the frickin' extractor up. We're even gonna connect them. It'll be beautiful. And build another fucking oxygen generator, right? Just for that fucking biodome alone. Not putting oxygen anywhere else. Just that biodome. Will that please you? Built the oxygen generator and then oxygen was going way down on everything. <laughs> and since I really don't need the money from visitors, like, I could have before I found out, you know, you know, it was possible to do that. Uh, I think I should probably change my landing permissions and turn off visitation. Just say, colonists, just give me colonists because I want to hit that 300 and get that last milestone. Be like, yeah, I've done it. Incoming to a large group of wounded soldiers asking for help. They need health. Yeah, sure, come on. Okay, I'm going to make an airlock out there so they don't have to run around a whole huge distance just to 
access that part since I'm probably going to be c connecting even more things to the little uh wounded soldiers paid 300 coins for services jeez dorm is out of water dorm is out of power what the f oh that's because I just built it fucking I know that it needs to be built with the other thing I set it up to make sure that I had all the room that I needed so I wouldn't have to fucking recycle everything and I'm detruders but shut up about the fucking out of power and out of water wait till they come fucking actually connect it to the goddamn thing well they got one of my guards I got two of my guards. Yeah, Koban. They got my guards. Fuck. Oh, man. They got a, one of my workers. Shut up about the structures out of power and out of water. You know, it might matter once we actually have it connected to the grid. Then it'll be surprising. You don't need to alert me that the fucking thing that isn't plugged in isn't plugged in. I fucking know. We're just, we're just working on this. We got, yeah, They just need to frickin' weld it together. That's it. Come on. Don't you dare. Not stepping on the keyboard right now. I got... And I'm, I'm this close. I'm this close to getting all the little things. Okay, now just weld that shit. Weld that, that shit right there. They're still gonna complain about the fucking generator and shit. Koban? Yeah, that. Thank you. Hey, look at that. It's generating oxygen. Who'd have guessed? Koban, just get down. With your cat self. I. Bon, your claws is sharp. Alright. You know, that's the opposite of getting down, actually. I, I'm i just trying to do some planet basin. Trying to see how fast I can make it to 300. So far, it's not very fast. Been at this for about three hours. And I already was at a pretty good spot to start. Wondering if I should build more little spots for places to land, because, yeah. Places. What am I talking about? Yeah, just. Living. Laughing. Loving. And there's this whole area here that I could build out to. I, there are people that play Planet Base that are rather upset that the amount the space that you can build on is limited and indeed I was building very close to one of those limitations right here boom I'm not able to actually go any further that way that's why say build a giant fucking winter run it's like no all this area it's just it's an invalid location you just can't can't do it Okay, starports there. It's been connected. It's powered. I got a second starport. That's great. So I could have more, even an even faster amount of colonists coming in, potentially. Or terrorists. Either way. And I have a little more water if I can get that going. And my food situation's looking alright beer situation is a bit lacking. Maybe we need another bar. 
that waited long enough before I made it my first bar. Are you here to work or are you here as a terrorist? It's, it's, I did. Well, which one? Oh, the same damn one, of course. Build your dorms directly adjacent to an oxygen generator. Otherwise, fuck you. Also, build your bio domes directly adjacent to oxygen generators. Otherwise, fuck you. In fact, pretty much build the entire base. Just structure, oxygen generator, structure, oxygen generator, structure, oxygen generator, oxygen generator, oxygen generator, structure, oxygen generator. Okay, bar's done. It's great. Biologist was unhappy in the bar and left the bar unhappy. This is brilliant. One to go. Just one fucking colonist. And a sandstorm's coming, so... If they don't come soon, there's gonna be a... Problems. There's gonna be problems. We'll be waiting longer. And it's night time. Well, at least that means the sandstorm's not gonna fuck up any of my power anymore. Oh, 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 oh. Are you, are you there or are you terrorist? Oh, consolidation reached. Your colony now has 300 citizens. We're not going to tell you what this means achievement-wise. It's just the basic thing of what the fuck happened. You know. Boom! So, let me see. Milestones. Got them all! Survival, expansion, century, power monger, technocracy, self-sufficiency, standing, robotization, megalomania, and consolidation! Dorm is low on oxygen! Fuck em! And we're doing still very fucking well food-wise and all of that. And that's awesome because... Saved a game. No, no. Yes. This is very good news because now when we go to new game, there is a class S. I didn't know there was a class S. But we can upgrade to a more challenging version of planet base, which is it just more challenging to start or more challenging overall? Because starting on that was just an extreme pain in the ass! But once you did... Once the colonists learned to not try to breathe in an area that had no oxygen in its atmosphere, they were surprisingly good at living! This, I don't know, though. We might find out next time I actually boot up Planet Base, which hopefully will be a little sooner than how long it took me since last time to boot up Planet Base. But yes! All ten milestones on the Class D planet did it! Ow. Until next time.